Welcome to Two and a Half Minutes, NCHA's TV show that brings you the latest in cutting horse news. This week brings us to the announcement of NCHA's newest vice president. Mike Rutherford, Jr. of Buda, Texas, has been elected to the position by a vote of the NCHA members. Ballots were tabulated Tuesday morning in the NCHA office. With a total of more than 2,400 ballots, they were received by the accounting firm of Whitley Penn and tabulated under their supervision. We need to continue to push the amateurs to help lead this association and be more involved. That way we are growing from our base and not trying to grow from the roof down. Uh, that will help add sponsors or give our staff a more marketable uh, item to market to bring in more sponsorships and continue to grow our purses. Rutherford will assume his duties as vice president at the general membership meeting on June 24th during the NCHA convention in Nashville, Tennessee, along with incoming Ernie Butte Miller Jr. and president-elect Barbara Brooks. Youth deadlines for photo and essay contests and the Whitney and Greg Welch Memorial Sportsmanship Award have been extended to this Friday. Great prizes will be awarded, including one $500 scholarship for each winner of the best overall photo and essay. Details and contest guidelines are in the February through May chatters and also available online at nycaonline.com. Speaking of the NYCHA, be sure to check out their new Countdown to NYCHA's Spectacular Summer. Each Friday, a new video will be posted, so be sure to check it out. This week's rerun is 2003 Futurity Non-Pro Champion Scott Ferguson riding Laredo Blue. Click the reruns banner on nchatv.com each week to see a new video. Well, that wraps up our two and a half minutes. I'm Jennifer Lavin. Be sure to check us out next week as we bring you more of the latest cutting horse action. Or as always, check us out on nchatv.com.